we do know that um, 8% of patients in the National Audit of Cancer Diagnosis in primary care reported that they did have abdominal pain before they were diagnosed. Um, but because it's such a non-specific symptom associated with lots of different cancer sites, there isn't a single pathway for cancer testing in patients with abdominal pain. What we found was that the overall risk of any of these cancers in the patients uh, was higher for men uh, than it was for women, and it increased with age, which is what you'd expect based on the, the incidence. But the overall cancer risk in these patients was greater than that expected based on their age and sex. And we found that the colorectal cancer was the most likely um, for all ages and both sexes across the board, um, and followed by pancreatic and then esophagastric cancers and also ovarian cancer for women. So cancer remains less likely than other possible causes of abdominal pain. And we're certainly not advocating that men aged 70 or more with abdominal pain should be sent off for cancer testing without other indications of a possible cancer. But we, we wonder if there's a case to consider using non-invasive fit testing in such men.